Alrighty, so I made it to my hotel and I figured might as well give it a tour. So this is a four star hotel. Usually I don't stay at places this nice, so I don't know. This is called the International, or no, Intercontinental. I don't even know where I'm staying. Anyway, but like four star hotels are pretty nice because they have like kind of funky stuff that you normally don't get. So like starting with this, do not disturb button and then makeup room button. So I guess you get to choose if you want them to clean your room. I don't know, it's interesting. Um, and then here's like the room itself. So I've actually never been to San Francisco, which is strange because I live like an hour flight from here, which is weird because I've been to like every big West Coast city, actually not Portland either. Not Portland, not for San Fran, everywhere else. In like the entire West. Like I've been to Idaho, I've been to Yellowstone, I've been to Utah, Arizona, like Vegas, actually not New Mexico, but anyway, a lot of places. Okay, there's still places to go. Anyway, there's like a cool, look at this. It's like a double window kind of thingy going on. So let me see. There we go. Oh, view of San Francisco. Oh, I wonder if I can see the bridge. Mm, no. A lot of people walking around. I asked if it was safe to walk around and they're like, if you go this way, it's safe. If you go that way, it's not safe. So I won't go that way. Anyway, I'm, I'm going to like, okay, this is sad. <laughs> I'll vlog it and I hate to admit this. So it's like 7.30. And so I have some time, and on our way here, I was like, oh, there's a target. Like, like a, I mean, in the good direction to walk, so that way. Anyway, it was the good direction to walk, and so I was like, oh, maybe I can look for cutie cars, because usually in cities is like where you find good toys, because like there's not as much kids in like a downtown area. So this is like a prime spot to find like maybe rare cutie cars. That's what I'm hoping for, like a limited edition. That'd be cool. Um, I'm gonna like wash my hands and stuff. Okay, so. Sorry, I'm talking fast. Um, I have like a tiny bag because, you know, I'm only staying one day. Ta-da, here's my bag. Um, and I just want to show you guys something. This will show how crazy and neurotic I am. So, da -da -da, computer. Okay, so whenever I travel, I always bring um, hand soap because hotels never have like, oh, where is it? There we go. Um, Hotels never have like hand soap. Let me put this on. Oh, holy nice bathroom. Look at this. Holy cow. There's a bathtub and a shower. Ooh, nice. Okay, this is nice. But anyway, they never have like antibacterial soap. Like they have, what's this? Like natural like face soap and other like face soap, but they don't have like liquid hand soap. So I seriously brought with me like in a shampoo bottle liquid hand soap because I'm like, weird or like really uptight about washing my hands, like super uptight about washing my hands. So, um, you know, if you ever see me, um, most likely my hands will be very clean. You can shake my hands because I'm like neurotic about that. Anyway, well, let me wash my hands and then we'll go to Target. Yay! Alrighty, here I am, San Francisco Target. And we're like right downtown, so cutie cars. Let's see what we got. Um, oh, okay, this is good. Okay, so we got like a mix of season one and two. So we got season two, our Wheelie Sneaky, and then tons of Jelly Joy Ride, which is kind of cool one, I was surprised. The lemon, I think it's like pop, the foods that aren't as popular don't get bought, even though it's like a cool looking car. Anyway, um, let's look for some other, ooh, Shopkin season nine. Oh, and the brand new Happy Places. So they have Happy Stables now. And Ava's gonna love this because she likes horses right now. Um, those are cute. Yeah, like the season nine is selling out pretty good, so that's good. And same with the Happy Stables, I feel like that's selling out pretty good, so that's that's good news. Um, Hatch and Walls are like totally sold out. A lot of this stuff is sold out, like a little surprise. Okay, it's actually pretty rare to see them in stock, so this is pretty good. But they're really expensive, like $10.59 for one ball. I'm like, eh, I'm cool. I'll buy two cutie cards instead. Um, Fingerlings is in stock here, which is actually really good. So they have a new glitter monkey? Baby monkey, oh, that's cute. Summer. Okay, so it's yeah, a lot of pink. Oh, oh, here's Emma. That's kind of cool. Look at that one. Once again, Emma. That's cute. I like that. And Emma's a popular name too, so I'm sure a lot of girls named Emma would like that. Oh, little cutie puppy. This is cool. I didn't get a case. I got like single pa packs. Oh, little live pet turtle. They have the baby one. Oh, and actually, this is the first time I've seen the fingerling. Park in like I bought it once. I haven't seen it in stock since. Oh, they got the little busy bubs too. These are like little live pet babies. These are cute. I wonder if one's out. Let's see if I can try it. Uh, oh, there we go. Like, Bouncy. That's cute. 
Um, hamsters in a house, I filmed that. What's this? Fabula Forest? Who will hatch? Oh, I didn't know they had these. Some of these I think are new for 2018. Um, so let's see. Um, let me find another okay, aisle. Okay, check it out. Huge, cool awesomeness. Look at this. So it's like a giant Target symbol, but made of toys on the inside. This is really creative. I've never seen anything like this before. Look, there's Cootie, Jesse from Toy Story, Mr. Potato Head, Rubik's Cube, Monster High, Play-Doh. Um, oh, wait, little people? Like there's Robin. Oh, La La Loopsy. A lot of these are like the younger kids toys. Okay, yeah, like the Fisher Price teapot. What is this? Does anyone know? Like, let me know in the comments. I have no idea what that is. Oh, Dr. Stephens, My Little Pony. There's Jesse again. I feel like they reused a lot of toys. Maybe they used like whatever was on clearance or something. Oh, there's a football player. Um, that's really cool. I gotta take a picture of that. Okay, what else do we got here? Oh, they have a big Barbie dream house. So this is the one with the garage. So this is like the kind of recent one. It's kind of interesting to be in this box because Oh yeah, it's just like all the loose pieces in there. That's weird. Alrighty, another aisle. So this is kind of like the crafty kind of stuff. We got slime kit candy chemistry. That's weird. That's different. Um, oh, the smooshins. This is fun. Honestly, I had a lot of fun with that. I don't know if this toy took off or not, but that was actually a really fun toy. Oh, the egg surprise. I actually really love this toy. That's a good one. Um, Orbeez. Wow, oh, look at this. Wow, that's cool. So you open it up like this. Weird. Okay, I'm sure there's gonna see a little. Yeah, that's cool. And you can like pour it all out. That's actually like that's really cool. Twenty bucks too. That's not. I don't think that's too bad. I mean, if you're filling a bathtub, then that's insane. Elmer's slime starter kit. Okay, this is smart. Very smart. Like Elmer's glue's got to be like doing so well <laughs> with the slime. Seriously, I think I read an article. And I totally don't remember the numbers, but it was like insane how much their sales increased because of slime. Also, they have new Legos. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Back it up. Check it out. This is cool. Brand new Lego Duplos. So they have Belle. That's cute. Spidey with the Hulk. That's pretty rare. And then I see new Princess Legos too. Like, I do not remember this one. This seems new. Ariel's Royal Celebration Boat. That's cute. Oh, and there's Sleeping Beauty too, and Cinderella. Oh, these are good. These are really good. Okay, so here's the Legos. Let's keep a walking. This is actually a pretty cool toy store. Like, I love toy stores in the city just because they're newer. Okay, so we went down this aisle. Got the baby alive. So yeah, let's try this. Okay. So here's all the Disney princessy stuff. I feel like the Disney princess dolls look kind of weird now. I don't know. I don't know if I totally like those. Vampirina. Oh, this is cute, Daniel's tiger. I love Peppa, so that's cool. And then we got like some like little kids toys. Oh, my kids love the Ben and Holly's Little Kingdom. And wait a minute, cutie cards. Da, 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 da. Okay, time to fill a cart. So here's all the season two. So we have the peanut butter and jelly pickup. The sneaker, the chase cookie, which is pretty cool. It's like a chocolate chip cookie. Bananas from season one, but I want a duplicate of that one because I feel like I don't have, I only have one. Anyway, yogurt cart and the ballerina slipper. So we're buying this and then also, I found this. I've never seen this before. It's like a gem dig, so it's like a treasure box and you, with sand. Sorry, it's like blurry, there we go. And you dig out gems. I think Ava would like seriously freak out about that. So I'll buy that too. Okay, so this is something I've never seen before. Fully robot cafe, so like robot coffee shop. So I can see, I don't really drink coffee, so I'll see if there's like hot chocolate. So let's see, da da da. Really good milk, interesting, really good. Chocolate, hot chocolate, yeah, why not? Okay, so let's see this. Um, oat milk, that's weird. Let's do that. Peppermint, okay. Standard. Okay, here it goes. It's making it. <laughs> this is so cool. There we go. Uh -huh. That's so cool. I'm trying to take a boomerang of it. Let's see. Let's see, so it's like filling it up. 
That's cool. So it's filling it up, adding milk, and there's like peppermint in it. And then once it's done, this thing, we'll grab it. And then serve it, and then we're done. That's cool. Just to pick it up. 1862. And then we'll grab it. And then give it to me. Okay, that's insanity. <laughs> it's like, bye! That's cool. And then there it is. That's cool. And then, oh yeah, you can get lids right here. Cafe X. This is the future. <laughs> this is really cool. Taste test time. Let's see if the machine made a good cup of hot chocolate. Mmm. That's really good. And the good thing, like, it's only $3 or in the city. That's not bad. And then also, too, like, you don't have to deal with people. <laughs> it's probably good for, like, someone who's antisocial. I don't know. But, um, honestly, it's really good.